Lisa likes the window seat at night, the lights below that tell her she's nearly home. Then there's the lights she can't see, the runway lights we power to bring her plane safely into land. And because at Energia we also power all of Ireland's streetlights, Lisa's taxi home is that bit safer too. And no prizes for guessing who powers her house. Welcome home, Lisa. Energia, the power behind your power. Yeah, it's, it's like you do one podcast and you're going to do it forever. It's like... I just do them every night anymore. Oh, for real? Yeah, that's okay, it's falling apart. God bless you, Jimmy. Well, why? Yeah, yeah, you know, your work ethic. I, I, like I, just, I, I do the things that fit. Right? Right. You know what You know what made me happy? When I, I emailed you and I'm like, I'm, I'm sitting there looking because yes. I don't know anything about the podcast, right? So I'm trying to figure out my schedule and I'm looking, trying to see if you email me back. And I'm not getting nothing. I woke up and you emailed me back at 5 o'clock in the morning. I was like, did this dude wake up at 5 a.m.? No. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. I try not to check my emails until from through till till I'm on the train at four, so that's what so yeah, right, that's when right. I check the emails because because as I travel. All right, welcome to the level of the people's mic. Introduce yourself. What's up? I'm Cheese. Cheese. Graham Cooper. What's Graham up? Cooper. Robin Dunlop. Robin Dunlop. Yeah, I I, I, I wake up at three. I, I'm out by four. I catch a train and then when I'm on the train, I handle my stuff. You wake up at 3 a.m.? Where do you live? In Jersey. In Jersey? Where in Jersey? Oh, What's well, your exact that's too much tell us, tell us yeah, more about your neighborhood. What's your apartment No, number? no, no. Tell, no. Me, tell How us big more is about your apartment. Well, well, in your well, area. It's, your it's the, the strip that I walk from the train home is the most racist oh, okay. that, I've, that I've seen. Jersey's is weirdly racist. Really? Yeah. I've it, never been. I've no, heard not to go. But 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 the black people do bullshit. So it's like, fuck. It's, it's, I don't know. Oh, I, don't, I, I want did. to say I it's Trenton. Fault, I went to Trenton the, once. All... I don't know how we ended up there, but we stayed in Trenton. Trenton? You make yeah. it sound so nice. Yeah, Trenton. It's my accent. Everything it's not as nice, nice as you make it sound. No, it's horrible. Like, it sounds we, lovely. My parents and I stayed there. <laughs> so we did a road trip from North Carolina to New York because mm-hmm. they went to NASCAR. That's my parents for you. And we took a drive and we went to like Gettysburg and Philadelphia, whatever. And then we stopped in Trenton because it said the capital of New Jersey. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was not no, there's fun. The, there's three places <laughs> you should like not. We took like a 30-minute Uber just sit, to get yeah, dinner. <laughs> what the world makes. Uh, Trenton, Trenton makes and the world takes. That's their motto. Oh. But then they don't make shit anymore. They don't make shit. I don't know what goes to no. Trenton. I mean, they had a cool street party. I, I did a show in Trenton years ago. I was like, this is not. People shouldn't live here. Um, um, it's like three places. Newark, Trenton, and Camden are like. The hard places in Jersey. Mm. Irving, it's like it's the pockets. Too. Yeah, Irving's it, but yeah. that's like that's like Newark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. New, Newark is just it's just a uh, it's, a, it's more deserted than it is. It's like a homeless shelter, like 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 Penn Station. I, I, no, you, Irvington's scary as shit. <laughs> that's that's I don't know if you remember Eastside High. That's where right is that is that Irvington? I don't, even, I don't even know because I don't huh? know. Is that Patterson? Yeah. Patterson, yeah, you're right. Oh, Fuck. Patterson. No, you don't. I know none of, <laughs> none of this. None of this shit. Um, um, I know Manhattan and Williamsburg. <laughs> I grew up in Bayonne, and I walked home naked from the projects in Bayonne, New Jersey. Wow. Uh, so, and everybody, like, it, it, Bayonne is such a weird place to be because everybody, like, there are people from Manhattan, like, yo, Bayonne's really ghetto. I'm like, really? <laughs> Have you ever been anywhere else in the world that you think Bayonne is hood? But then I'm like, I did walk home naked from the project, so maybe. They made you, or you just did it for, you oh, like you do it for fun. No, like, so that's the thing. White boy I was, thing? Like, I was doing I'm going to walk home through the hood. I yeah, was, make it. I was, <laughs> I was doing that. I was what doing that winter, kind of for extra. fun before <laughs> that. But no, this was like you're white, you're at the projects, it's 11 o'clock at night, and you're overdressed. <laughs> and then, they, yeah, feel like 15 of them maybe run away from the projects. Fuck. Yeah, Whoa. yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck. No, it was a good time. Sounds like a party. But you also touch. Yeah. 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 yeah, they're cool. Yeah, like, you know did all they say Happy New Year? I did, I did, I did, I did, I did. I, I even wrote a song about them that got back from years later. Yeah, but people are different when they're not in groups, because when they were in groups, they were robbing me. Oh, yeah. When they would come up to me years later by, the, by themselves. Only one guy yeah, needs to rob you. They're, they're like, no, when they would come up to me later, they'd be like, yo, I heard you wrote a song about me. And I was like, yeah, I would just do it. And like, oh, shit, that's dope. <laughs> it is. People, right. it's funny what groups do to people. Yeah. What are you up to? What am I up to? Trying to set you up. Trying to set me up yeah. for a thing that we already talked about yeah, earlier. Yeah, yeah. Supernatural yeah. segue. Yeah, supernatural segue. So I had 30 minutes to kill. You, you made it so bad. Yeah. That yeah. was terrible. No. <laughs> no, because the whole thing is contrived, isn't it? It's all fake. No. 
I had 30 minutes to kill before the mic, so yeah. I, uh, what did you do? I'm going to plug us. this new building that's next door, the new luxury development that uh, I went I, in. I, I touched that building on the way. Just you to, just, it. I yeah. touched it trying to get some good full luck. Because if, if I could live anywhere, it'd be there. It'd they, be, they have a target. And, they do have a target. It's a really pretty they're building. building something else. So, yeah, so I went there, yeah. and Joseph, uh, the leasing agent, I went they're in, and Joseph. they're like, do you have an appointment? I was like, no, but I have half an hour. Yeah. And, <laughs> <laughs> half an hour? Well, with that, with that fit, you're a door. You look like you have yeah. rich parents. You look like I look like that, yeah. I have 30 and they, minutes. Okay. I have 30 minutes. They accepted what, do you, what do you got for me? They accept, and they're like, so I looked at some, some of the two bedrooms, and they're like $8,000 a yeah. month. Yeah. Which is $8, crazy. $8,000 a month. That's like that's 5 insane. million rand. What? <laughs> a month. That's how I see money. You know, it's like 5 million bajillion dollars. All I'm saying like, is. What, what kind of job do you have to have to fucking. I see people coming in and out of there. He didn't even ask me what I do. No. I don't have a job. <laughs> me, they would have been like, can we check your credit? Uh, like when you walk in? Yeah, just, yeah. the guard would have checked my credit. You were saying they yeah, have a, a lottery thing? How yeah, they have uh, – They, I saw – I did apply for – New York has um, a Housing Connect lottery oh, where yeah? you can apply for certain certain places wow. and get like – because they have to give a certain amount of apartments away to low income. And, and, oh. and give so – Give me low income to, to back to the You have to be a regular person in New York. That's yeah. it. Like when I – A number regular low, person yeah, is like low a, it's like There's like two lines. It's like everybody who's like just making it and the people who are just here so for fun, loaded, yeah. you know, and, and – and, mm-hmm. Like, like you got to make I don't know what it is, but um, yeah, and and the, it's supposed to be affordable housing, but mm. still at some of these places, it's still bananas. Because like, like, it's like I applied for uh, what's the place on Street? Uh, uh, oh, um, it's got a goofy name. Sucker thing. What's the, what's the name of the product, those houses over there? Do you know? No, Fuck, I, I applied for those, but the, yeah. the lowest one is three thousand. Three thousand yeah. dollars. I was like. As the lottery, Shana like, can live there, low but income the people. rest of us. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. This is, this is yeah, I'm not going to apply for that lottery. I, 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 used to, I used to do that as a kid, and my mom was like, bro, she took it away. She was like, you go get it. Don't dream or some bullshit. Yeah, yeah. He, he I remember just, he <laughs> she, I, was, I used to collect floor plans, but I remember doing that. Collect that was my favorite thing for Sunday. Like, yeah, look at this big house. Same, you didn't have, yeah. like, the Sims. Yeah, I, before the internet, <laughs> before all of that. Oh, wait, you're really old, I forget. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I you used to build houses horizons. on a computer. Uh, 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 what <laughs> do you not do this, though? It might, like, I, and then I can't I, be alone, I, right? when, when I'm in a relationship, I'll go to a lot of open houses, but I don't go by myself. No, see, I, yeah. <laughs> I have a black man complex, and I was like, it, anything they say is because I'm We black. should go together. That would be fun. That just would to be watch fun. the reaction. That would be amazing. I was trying to get girls from, the, from the dating apps to go. Do you have thirty minutes to kill off to this? <laughs> yes, we can. We can, we can try it. Do it. Yeah, maybe we Joseph. Joseth, we'll go I'm, not Joseph. I'm not going with you. No, he'll make us. I'll put my hand. Hand. You, uh, I was like, who the fuck is the guy with the tie <laughs> and the black guy? No, I have a tie complex. I feel like no matter what they say to me, it's because I'm wearing a tie. You know what I'm saying? Well, maybe you should wear a tie with my face. But I, I did the same thing. Last week, uh, I went to the Tesla dealership. Uh-huh. And, uh, did and you test oh, drive a car? car. I don't have a license. No, because I don't have a license. Electric- <laughs> I don't, they they would have still I gave have. I feel like this. Thing. No, but they gave me a test they, ride. Okay. They're like, they drove me around. Today. They drove me around. And yeah. I had to. I wonder if you can get like, a test ride to a place you need to go. Like, could well, you? Well, they said, do you want us to drop you at your apartment to pick up your license? Yeah. But I don't even have a license. So I was like, you don't oh. have an apartment. I don't have an apartment. I don't have an apartment. Can you drive over to Mike? Like, yeah. <laughs> go downtown. Autos. Two Autos. I want, a, I want a Model 3 more than anything now. It's such a fun car. Though. It does look like a fun car. Yeah. It's so quick. So, you know Elon Musk invented Tesla? Yes. Right. Yeah. So Elon Musk and I went to the same high school. Shut the fuck up. Wow. Yeah. I same year? Got bullied same person? And, no, not oh, the same, same oh, year. Same year. <laughs> I was like, I thought he was young. <laughs> no, he's not that young. Is he? Who's like four? No, uh, he, no, he got bullied mind. and Let's left. Not, yeah. he's like, Shut up. He got bullied? Shut up. He got bullied and left. And then he went awesome. to another Of course school. he did. And then it's I fucking know, Elon. He doesn't get bullied. He gets bullied now. To shoot rockets. What? Where is it now? He's fucking older than me. <laughs> it didn't go at the same time, but I too have super intelligence and was bullied. Super intelligence? Damn, what is it? I'm backing myself, Jamie. I'm trying to remember the last. 
No, I, mean, I, I was bullied, but it was it was on uh, like a usual suspect's bully. Like, well, I wasn't like, like my head shoved in a toilet. It was more no, like no, it's you're just, pretty, but you're not like the prettiest. So like you're not the hot bitch, but you're not like ugly. So we don't know what to do with you. So they built my sense of humor. So you just cool. confused the bullies. Also, my surname is Dunlop. Like I don't know about here, but in South Africa, that's kind of a big deal. What is, with the with the tires and the sports. Is it the Rockefeller? No, it's not <laughs> like the Rockefellers <laughs> though with like tire brand. Tire. <laughs> they make rubber? Like rubber. <laughs> Somebody once called my That's mom the rock. Michelin man. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> um, 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 what else happened? What are we talking about? I'm just buying the shit. Comedians I don't have money. around the world thing came out. Yeah, I mean, anybody watch that or only me? I'm, I'm, <laughs> so I'm, I, 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 I watch. This, this is what I do with all comics that I hear for the first time. I watch up to their first laugh. Oh yeah. And, and then see how long their first laugh takes, and that, that's okay. it. Like most most foreign comedians, I can't listen to. Like the and yeah, like the French Canadians. Why why can't you listen? It's just like the, the accent. And, the yeah, it's, and yeah, it's like, because he's I wonder what that's like. Huh. What? Hearing all the accent. Yeah, I know. Right? I mean, even, even like Neil Brennan was like, I got through all the Americans, and then I got through uh, some of the English in the UK and South America. I'm, I'm happy with you, and then uh, I met South America, but uh, but like you, I, I heard some of their bits. Yeah. Before I heard him when he was here. But, yeah. And, and, I mean, it got a little better because he does a lot. But yeah. I don't know. You should definitely watch the South African ones, Young Plug. <laughs> Not that I'm on no. it, but like. <laughs> If, if the South Africans get attention, maybe I can move. Good. British comics are some of the best. Or do you think different from Next time, raise your hand, please, Shannon. <laughs> <laughs> you know, a flat, a light. Interesting question. All questions must be submitted in writing. I don't know. A lot of it, so I find that we talk about different things. So a lot of the American stuff is very sexual, that kind of stuff. And especially with the feminist movement, we talk a lot about that here. But like South Africa, we still have a lot of racial connotations to our stuff. Um, I would say a lot more like that. And like, so I've noticed that South Africans make a lot of jokes about the Holocaust because it makes like apartheid seem less bad, I suppose. Um, I know yeah, we had a part time. Yeah, yeah, we didn't do We were the Holocaust. It's not like everyone's got nuts. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but it's, it's an easier thing because we have such a diverse country that it's easy to go oh you know you guys do this we do this you know so everyone like kind of and i mean honestly i've learned so much about the different cultures just from watching stand up in south africa yeah. where here it's like so he put his dick in my butt Woo! like like is that that's nothing amazing is that would you say that i know that's that guy how you see, like, <laughs> yeah. like up and coming female comedians um not everyone, but I like the girls who try and do something a bit different. Well, you you come know? To, to... Like, talk about more like day-to-day <laughs> stuff. You know? Yeah, or like, yeah, yeah. You gotta take, speak up. Take a different, sure. um, speak up. like, look at things. You know? Because I went, so two years ago I started Man Up and I went to an open mic at Lansing where it was all ladies. And like no, that was here. You got one more question. And, oh, the lantern. <laughs> yeah, the lantern. <laughs> and they were like, six women in a row that all spoke about the same thing and they're like oh but i'm different and special i'm like talk about something else you know but it's a safe place and i get it because we're all so new and trying to work out and you start with yourself you know you start with the basics the dating that this is what i do what am this is my name whatever so that's yeah that's you, you you could tell that a lot of them don't get a lot of stage time like mm. like because you, like yeah. that's yeah. that's the difference between New York com- comedians and everybody else is that we have so much stage time. So and much you can, stage you can, time. You can you and yeah, but it's almost like you you oh, take it for granted. Huh? Like I know I took it for granted yeah. at the beginning because I was like, well, I can just get stage time. But when mm-hmm. I went back home, yeah. you can't just get stage time. You no. can't just go and pay five dollars and get stage time. Yeah. You know, you gotta. There's a show and there's audiences. So that's the hardest thing for me is going back to an open mic mm-hmm. after a year and a half of. Solid audience. Did you did you start a show? You yeah, a show? so I have you a show back. Show. Yeah, and then and then the restaurant shut down for drug laundering. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Tell you. So I didn't do it, but yeah. yeah it's a credit. Um, <laughs> yeah, so that's also the kind of stuff we talk about, like drugs you know, lots of crime credit. in yeah, South Africa. Sure. So we like try and make humor out of that. But we're more conservative in general, I would say, in terms of that. Oh, really? 
but yeah, but I'm starting a, a monthly show that's gonna that doesn't help anyone here because it's in South Africa. You, but you if can, you're uh, around, this technology you can you can Skype them in now. Right? Yeah, you can fly us out. I should do so that. Should although the Skype microphone in. fucked out the last time, so no, <laughs> Skype s- might be an issue. Skype in American <laughs> so you're, comics. You're back and forth between here and South Africa. Yeah. Well, I'm just visiting at the moment, <laughs> but like because I started here, I wanted to come back. You know, as soon as I could, just so people remember that I exist. <laughs> right? Yeah. Like, I came you gotta back. You got to say, Rona, you start over. Yeah, like, you know? I got back and like, went to the Grizzly Pear holiday party. You know? And I used to hang out at the Grizzly Pear all the time. <laughs> and I saw, like, eight people that I recognized. I'm like, who are all these other comics? Yeah. This is so yeah. strange. The but comedy scene is so wild to me. Like, I started rapping when I was younger. And the rap scene was just so grimy. I was like, I'm not a big enough asshole to be a rapper. Yeah. I'm definitely a big enough asshole to be a comedian. Yeah. But I'm not, and then it's yeah. like, it's there, like are com- there are fucking holiday parties at comedy clubs. <laughs> like, what were they having holiday parties on like the street corners and shit? You know what I mean? It was like, rap battle Christmas edition. <laughs> no, it's, so, it's, I hear, like, this was the first real holiday that I've been involved in comedy. And like hearing everybody, oh, we're going to the party. Oh, what? <laughs> really? It's like that friendly? Yeah, when, I went to the what? first Christmas party. And I was like, I don't want to do this. I didn't, yeah. I didn't like it. It was like all comics and all. I was like, ah, get the but fuck. I didn't want to touch to, anybody. It's important to connect with people that have a similar interest. So I suppose it's also different again because our scene is so small. So yeah, like there's yeah. very few people that understand us. So yeah. we kind of stick together. I guess. Yeah. I, no, I was Here, really, there's so yeah. many where yeah, you're like, so well, <laughs> we don't like those I was like, people. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Uptown comics. Boom. You were doing you a know? lot of there were a lot of female comics at this Christmas party. I was like, where the fuck are you at at two fifteen? <laughs> Three o'clock. No, They're across the street. Yeah, across the street. <laughs> I was really relieved though that like how nice comedians were because I was I was scared of like comics when I first started getting into it. And then I started meeting. I was like, oh, they're like really nice people. Oh, some people are really it's, like, nice. I felt like yeah. uh, in New York comics, I was like, I was like, nobody's gonna be nice yeah. to me, and like most people are really fucking nice. And I was like, whoa, this is so yeah. much better than rap. It's not Jimmy. Like, this, this, yeah, this is so, yeah, much, better so much better than, we're, than we're rap. One, like, I love that your comparison yeah. is stand up comedy and rapping. <laughs> <laughs> What like you ran through the projects naked once, like you know what I'm saying? You know the ghetto. Try to take a card from you. <laughs> like that black no, card. No, you want to hear my comparison to rap? I was studying yeah. to be a priest before I started rap. Oh wow, yeah. that makes more sense. And then, and then yeah. I had like a major mystical awakening, and the angels were like, "Go rap." <laughs> <laughs> And next thing you know, I was running home naked from the fucking project. What's wrong with that? Nothing, really. No, I was was really, I was really at nothing. A little weird here and there. Do you not know that story? It's like, and then Gabriel came down and said, spit some bars. I was like, pass this, son. (laughs) Pass this, yeah. (laughs) And then I talked to him. like, this is a view. I talked to the Archangel Michael, and I was like, is it okay that I smoke this much weed? And I won't tell you what he said, because you won't believe me. He's like, oh, the burning bush. Hello. He said, smoke some more, you pussy. In the beginning, we smoked. Smokes marijuana all the time. This actually this happened. Yeah, this happened. Yeah. He said, "But the problem is, it stops you from learning." And then I actually you smoked the wrong one. I, <laughs> no mushrooms are what yeah, makes yeah. you learn. Yeah. But, but I went into the different ancient traditions, mm-hmm. and I found out that that's actually pretty standard. That like yeah. you smoke weed before you have like a real awakening, yeah. and then once you have a real awakening, you can't smoke weed anymore. Syria had the strongest weed, right? Syria. But so yeah. that's yeah. I, 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 I remember Michael. Michael. <laughs> <laughs> the problem is, you had the awakening, then you carried on smoking weed, and then it went to rap. But no, like I, I actually couldn't meditate. Like when I when I you kept when I kept smoking weed, oh, when yeah? I smoked weed, I couldn't hold a real meditation practice. Oh, so you meditate? Like, yeah, no, I teach meditation, but it was like oh. I, I couldn't actually hold a real meditation practice high all the time, and that's when I realized I was like, <laughs> I got to trade in the Buddha to go meet Buddha. Yeah. <laughs> and that, that's how that happened. Yeah, it's just they had to go, they had to go. Now it's like that's mushrooms three or four times a year. But shh, I didn't say that. Yes. No, because like oh, I forgot all the types of mushrooms in the world. Um, Carry on. Button mushrooms, they're fine. They're, they're, about to legalize, them, yeah. they're trying to legalize mushrooms next, right? Yeah, really? in uh, Oregon, I think. Yeah. yeah. Oregon, yeah. Oregon. that's a herb. <laughs> they're trying to get everything. Everything. But there's I, no reason to, for them to be illegal. You know, there's, if you can regulate and make money off it, why not? The only reason to keep the mushrooms state. illegal is because the entire world will be thoroughly different. Like I really like if you. I don't pay- think because you legalize it, everyone's gonna be like, "Cool, I'll so eat them well. now." No, but you, no, but you know, but like, look at what happened to culture. Like, what's we've been legal now for like five, six years out west? Like, and Donald Trump is president. Like, check. I don't think. Check the correlation. So check, the correlation check, it, check the correlation. Check the correlation. Check the correlation. He's trying to turn it back. Right? Check the check the correlation. Check the correlation, right? Because what you have is. 
what we yeah. does is it expands your context, right? It's yeah. like you now have a different context for thought. Now I'm not I'm not like advocating for Trump. Just, I'm not advocating for Trump. Okay. Like just I don't think it was the Trump supporters who were, who were smoking. No, Trump I don't think he, I don't think it's either. I think that there was a radical shift in the collective psyche that actually made space for a more chaotic. The problem pen. is the Democrats were too high to go and fucking vote. <laughs> That makes sense. Yeah. No, the yeah. problem was Hillary Clinton. <laughs> <laughs> there, nobody was going to vote she for Hillary Clinton. She's boring, man. Right? Yeah, she's like, wow. like, Hillary Clinton was smoking weed on stage. Like, it was like, like Hillary, Hillary Trump or Trump. I, I almost voted for Trump. I was like, Let, let's see what happens. Ah, fuck. I felt the world shake, but I touched I the button. I saw so much from my president. Like, like, yeah, I touched the button. I was like, yeah, I touched the I was like, yeah, <laughs> that's like that's should we fuck around? But I felt, I felt, I don't know if it was the booth or the gust of wind. No. I was like, don't. What do you mean you touched the button? The button that said vote for Trump? Do you yeah, we have buttons? Paper oh, yeah. Huh? <laughs> it's Jersey. Paper? We have buttons. Oh, just press a button. Like, <laughs> fucking paper, Jersey. Yeah. Dude. Fucking idiots. <laughs> we have to like, like write shit down. It <laughs> it's like two no. buttons. It's Yo, like, oh. I, was, I wasn't doing shit with the election. I, I was trying to rub my dick for president, right? Like, when both parties are soft on crime, Cheese's dick will take the hard stand needed for justice, right? And I put out this whole campaign, <laughs> and, and I wasn't going to vote. And you didn't win? No, yeah. not, no, my dick, my dick got like three votes, but... Well, uh, you did well, well in the Electoral remember, College. Remember, remember these nuts? Remember that? Remember that? Remember that? These nuts, the black guy that was trying to run for, for president? He's Rambe like, vote for these nuts. Remember these nuts? I was like, yeah, I'll vote for that guy. Why not? <laughs> Fuck. These nuts. <laughs> that was so good. <laughs> but what, what happened to me that was crazy with the Trump thing was that when the FBI director came out and was pretty much like, don't vote for this bitch. And when I saw Julian Assange locked in an asylum, like locked in an embassy because he was coming out against her, yeah. I was like, this woman is crazy. And I almost went out to vote for Trump. It was like two o'clock in the afternoon, but it was like 40 degrees that day, maybe like 39 mm-hmm. degrees. I had my baby with me. And I was like, I am not taking my son out to vote for this douchebag right now. Like, I'm not doing that. So at 8 o'clock, I ran to the voting booth, but I got there late. So I officially didn't vote for anybody. So it was like, thank God. Because then he got in and I was like, You must be so proud. Oh, I'm so happy that I (laughs) forgot to pull out and had a baby to stop me from doing that shit. (laughs) Like, it was, yeah, it was. I'm... I can't believe you have a child, but <laughs> <laughs> I like one and a half. Yo, I'm married to a doctor too. I, I, I can't so believe I don't. And he, yeah. I, I, I should have so many, like so <laughs> should, should, little countries. <laughs> I, I don't. Well, well, you can call it that. <laughs> <laughs> My, what else never mind. She swallowed. All right, I don't know. <laughs> this, this is not where I want this podcast to go. Where um, do you want it to go? I, I don't know. I don't know. I, do I was almost in a car accident the other night. That's, you were almost in a car. Accident? I, not in a car accident. I was. I was ordering Chinese food. We can talk ordering about that. Chinese food. And um and uh, uh, there was a car accident right outside. Like there was a car chase. <laughs> I don't like what? your face. You're like really? What? Um, um, really? We didn't tell us this more. <laughs> I, I, I felt love him because he was It was a van. A van hit somebody's yeah. car, smashed into it, yeah. and a, and a, and then the guy who was in the car ran, and the cops were like, "Hey, go get him!" And they, they spread out, shut the block down, and then the, and uh, I. Had Are the cops here like Brooklyn Nine Nine, or is that not a good representation? <laughs> they're 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 because I'm older. It's like watching NBA players now. It's like I'm older than them. Yeah. But they're younger, but they're more successful. So yeah. so it's like I'm older. They have more power, but they still like I would. They're like. 20 year old guys yeah. with guns. It was like, I don't think, I don't, I left. I was like, give me my food and get the fuck out of here because I'm not, more importantly, I don't want to be questioned. What did you order? Um, I ordered my regular was uh, shrimp and and steamed vegetables. That's all I ordered. Shrimp that's your regular? That's my regular. That's Why the is that only your regular thing. Shrimp? Because I saw, because I'm a conspiracy theorist and I know sometimes Woo! it's uh, it's not beef and it's not chicken. And and I've never been to the same Chinese restaurant and had the same texture of chicken. So I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I don't know. I, so you're like, at least, at least, you at least it, look, shrimp. it looks. At like least a it shrimp. looks like what I think a shrimp should look like. <laughs> Even though I went to one shrimp, and I saw like I saw like six kids like peeling the tails off of the shrimp, yeah, and, like little baby hands, little and I was like, kids. yeah, they, they. So you're like, I'll support the child. I support child, child labor, but you know, it's, it's baby hands. Hands. It, it yeah. should make the food more expensive. Like yeah, if they if they market it, they really get like, it. Yeah, you know, made like the from shells the shells peeled by baby hands. I would go to that baby. restaurant. 
Like you do. Go to that. <laughs> I mean, I do. Heard if you like walk past and they like the window is just children and people. But they are they are in the windows. Like I never. What if they were killing the chickens as well? So you like have children like killing the chicken right there, so you know it's a chicken. But mm-hmm. then it's fresh. Yes, I probably would. That but bleeding it out in the window. But what if it's like a corn-fed mutated chicken that they're killing? Oh, okay. I don't care what it's mutated with. As long as it's real, with what corn. I think a chicken is. But it's not even real anymore once it got steroids and all that bullshit. No, it's, it's not just real. Not like it's a strong. Chicken. This is not a chicken the way that a chicken was born. I would, it doesn't like, matter. I would, I would eat a strong, so real right. chicken if it was killed in front of when me. Besides what they ever say in the media. All right. I, I, I see what you're saying. So you're actually more concerned that you're getting like rubber mats and fucking. I don't know what the fuck. With, like, I, 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 I saw. I, I was driving by one place where I used to live in Delaware, and she had mice outside. She 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 was sitting there barefoot <laughs> by the trash can with a crock pot, just chopping this meat up. And I was like, Yo, I'm so happy Look, to be right now. If you don't know, <laughs> and it tastes no, good. no. <laughs> We well, had this I don't want to see the process. Theory. I want to see that process. We had this I, I that was like, just get the a couple shirt. years ago that like all the stores in our country were selling zebra meat and saying it's beef. But we're like, if, if, you, if you're yeah, honest, yeah, it tastes good. I would eat lion meat. I would eat like. A, no, you don't want like a, a predator meat because of the parasites that oh, come from fuck. food. You want the vegetarian animals. <laughs> I don't care about being vegan, that. but I'll eat the vegans. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Dude, I, I remember I was looking. All right, that's I'll eat beef. I was looking for lion beef, 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 beef. Was it lion beef jerky? Beef jerky. Yeah. Oh, both wow. Wow. Yeah. 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 Is they the said it makes you strong. Lion beef jerky. Yeah, lion beef jerky. That's yeah. Crazy. yeah that's I've never had that, but now I kind of want to try. Yeah, I want to. Yo, lion beef jerky. Break veganism. That's the they first thing. They can't sell it anymore. Yeah. Illegal. Oh, so really? I was. Yeah. Is it in South Africa though? Yeah. Oh no, I've never seen lion. But why can't they sell lions? Like, what's the deal? Like, why aren't they allowed to sell lions? Because lions are the white animal. people of the jungle. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> it was black. black if it was black panther. It'd be like, hey, we got this black panther meme. We just that has to be like a dark lion. That, like, no, <laughs> that. no. scar. <laughs> yeah, like, like it. you see, the, the, they try to save the white rhinos, but then they got like the forty thousand black rhinos. The <laughs> black rhinos are good. <laughs> are they as <laughs> yeah. endangered? Yeah, the, actually, the black yeah, rhinos. So are they got a couple. They got a couple the thousand. There's only like three white the black rhinos. rhinos. There's only two black rhinos, and they're both female. The last no, uh, well, no, that's no, white rhinos. No, guys, you're all lying. Read no, I the trust fucking them. book. <laughs> no, black rhinos are more. Endangered this doesn't fit my rhinos, joke. But there are no yeah, but he looks like he knows rhinos. He does. He knows rhino sex. There were two. It was two. It was two rhinos. Whatever they were, and one old one. They were like half his age. They were like, we're never fucking this guy. If, you can see it in their face. They are, oh, okay. They, that's all that's on the planet. Is these two female black rhinos. No, because there is a strain like that. That's true, but like in South Africa, we have gang black rhinos. Okay, not a lot. Gang bang rhinos. Gang black rhinos. Oh shit! <laughs> but you don't know the gang bang. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I don't they're, uh, they're actually. <laughs> I don't believe this. <laughs> <laughs> gang bang rhinos. <laughs> gang bang rhinos. No, yeah, they're, have they're a punk rock band from Kitchen. Oh and god. We have like wild. Fucking stupid. I think they're okay. No, um, 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 I bought um, a bracelet. I don't pay for that. I hope they're fine. What do you want to close this with? <laughs> I'll leave it to you. You just sit there. Um, so if someone could give me eight thousand dollars a month to go afford that apartment next door to Otto Schumacher. Did, did I say I touched the building just for good luck? Every yeah, time I walk yeah. by it, just that's kind of crazy. Every time you walk by, almost every. That's why they so wouldn't let you in. Just like the glass of the I don't live here. That's why they wouldn't let you in because they're like they're they don't the weird see guy me that touch. I don't like hugging the glass, <laughs> licking the glass. <laughs> like, <laughs> When when they had the uh the the lottery up there, everybody would be on the glass, and just like touching it, and looking at it. It looked like that. But when yeah. you call the lottery, it's not shit because they said all of the studios and one bedrooms are are gone. Like they uh, uh, they filled so them. So maybe it's like a lottery for the just for, for those. Um, I don't know. But maybe I maybe know. we can get them to do a lottery down there, and then we can just I, show I, up. I did want to do an open mic at at uh. At an open house. At open house. Did I say that? That's yeah, you did. Cool. And that. just see how far we can get. Just see how we can get twenty comics at a big, like, big ass house. Yeah. Half an hour. See how many people we can get. But it have to be somewhere in like the suburbs, because like, Nobody's because that's like a true like open like walk in off the lawn. Is that your daughter? That's my. Is she a comedian or she left? No, she's going to do comedy. 
Oh, oh she brought her mom. It's so cute. Of I can't course. wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, my mom's here. Oh, so yeah. hey, Sandy brought your mom. I know. <laughs> Who's the Spanish girl with her mom? <laughs> I was standing for that. That one of the ones you would take your money that I said that this open mic is worth her playing ticket. You dressed like you're gonna. I should have had you on. That's so good. Um, 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 we gotta close this out and get this started. Uh, uh what can we find you online? Um, Jesus Christ Nine. Jesus Christ, Christ. <laughs> Makes sense, right? Yeah, yeah. Makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Have you ever seen that movie, My Best Friend's Girl? No. Welcome to Cheese's Pizza, where every pizza is a religious experience. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be, I'm definitely going to steal some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. uh, website? No, no website. No, no website. No website. No website. No website. Twitter? Well, yeah, just Twitter, Instagram, Jesus Christ Nine. Um, I give you my phone number, but Jimmy wouldn't let us know where he lives. So no, not hell no, hell no, don't do that. <laughs> you never know what the future holds. So somebody's like, I was watching your podcast. What's your fax number? Yeah, no fax. You still use fax? Fax. Okay. Even my doctor stopped using fax, and that took a while. I wouldn't even know how to how to figure out how to use a fax with all the technology. You know, Google, even Google is like, why? I have a question. Did you in your lifetime, okay, maybe you, hear oh, the shit. dial tone? Of when internet like logs yeah, on. Yeah, the yeah. upload. Yeah. 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 When it didn't okay. go through and you didn't that pay your bill. That was my lifetime. Oh, <laughs> 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 yeah, hell yeah. Okay. You know, we, and we were happy Did you ever hear to that? Hear it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and we were happy The dial up. I remember when I should first came out. Oh, like, yeah. <laughs> It was it was yeah. chat rooms and shit. It's like coming because yeah. it was like because it did it, it, it was one that went through when you connected and there was one that you didn't connect. With. So when you connected, it was like doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah. it was like a happy sound. Yeah. So then the other one was like eh. yeah. It was like nah, pay your shit. <laughs> you guys got it easy. I never heard that you didn't pay your shit one. <laughs> <laughs> Grew up in China. <laughs> Where can they find? Um, Instagram Bram Comedy. Daniel. Instagram, yeah. comedy. That's kind of it. That's it? Yeah, no like website. Instagram. Twitter? Facebook? No. No. Spotify. Uh, Snapchat? <laughs> Pinterest? I have, I have Snapchat. Website? For you. Still not a website? <laughs> Why do I need Flickr. a website? You need, what am this I doing? is your business, I don't know what right? Flickr is. <laughs> what? Get a website. We need an apartment first. No. no. You get a website. <laughs> get something to sell on your website. And, and hustle Like it. merch like you? Like merch. Yeah. Don't like me. More like you. Don't don't do anything like me. Mine's still shit. Get merch. Yeah, yeah, I He's do. He's got ninety yeah. items of merch. <laughs> I'm buying. So. But I get a get his t. Wait till the new t-shirts come out. Yes, I've got t-shirts. Do they say like I challenge and shit? Yeah, I do have a challenge. I, I, I don't think you have a challenge. Somebody shirt. somebody you took the one when I looked it up. Somebody had a challenge accepted. Get a challenge shirt. Yeah, Somebody challenge had shirt. a challenge accepted yeah, yeah, shirt. Like I think that's do how like, I met your like, mother. <laughs> was that challenge accepted? Do the challenge, challenge and on the back of the rules of the challenge, like burpees are one oh, rules yeah, joke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll put the rules on the back. Okay. Beautiful. I'll do that too. Yes. <laughs> Good. Robin Dunlop Comedy on Instagram, RD underscore comedy on Twitter, Facebook, Robin Dunlop. And my website will be up this yeah, year. Yeah, it will. Uh, RobinDunlop.com. Yeah. You could totally tell who the millennial is on this podcast. Oh, right now. But and no, I am not on Tinder. Sorry, I gave up. I, I got a website for my band that I'm trying to start. It's called the White People's Band. But I need a comedy <laughs> with a last name White so we can be Nico white Wine? people's. Why don't you just have yeah, a He doesn't sing. White. Huh? But there was a kid. His name was, uh, uh, I don't even say his name because he punked out. But 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 uh, GoDaddy was Name like, "Hey, shit. we got this website that you bought. That you're gonna use it." And no, white I just want to say that it's white com. people's band. White you have a band? band? Yeah, it's, it's two guys playing the ukulele. Oh, that's well, saying, I I'll get a white guy. I'll change my last name to We'll practice. Just, I'll change, I'll we'll, we'll, just to be a part of the band. <laughs> I, just just, get like a, just Jimmy and the is. white people. I'll be white. Uh, I'll change the whole yeah, website. Just Jimmy. That's fucking corny. All right, Jimmy and his whites. In his whites. Thank you. <laughs> and Jimmy, where can they find you? I can be, uh, well, after we reset that bullshit. Oh. Yeah, that's, that turned off. So it didn't record any of no, that? No, it didn't. Okay. So it missed all of our, nope. this is where you can nope. find us. Nope. Now, how will the thousands of listeners know yeah, where to find because it? Because it's yeah. on here, and I put the sound on there, and that's why I do both. Uh, uh, so smart. 
This is another episode of the People's Mic. Uh, you can find it on iHeartRadio, Spotify, JimPeoples.com, JPeoplesTV. Uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel. We're here every day at 3 o'clock, followed by the open mic. What else? Pinterest. Pinterest? Yeah. Get Pinterest. Jim Peoples, absolutely. Pinterest. Get, get Pinterest. Uh, 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 yeah, give it up for them one more time. Thank you. Closing that out. Good. Thank you, guys. Woo. Appreciate it.